Hey guys! So this is a journal that I just finished and I was inspired by like cookbook, gardening. <laughs> um, it can definitely be used as an everyday journal. It can also be used as a travel journal or a food journal or um, if you just wanted to keep it as a recipe book which was also one way I thought it could definitely be used. I had this really uh, like cute it was like gardening fabric and there's like blueberries and jam and there's like a little gardening hat and all sorts of things in that field. <laughs> so um, I had these cool little frames that I had picked up at Michael's. I kind of used some vintage stain on this because it was actually like a, you know, like it was an unfinished wood color. And I had had these like forks and knives for a while and I had been trying to like think of a way to use it to incorporate it in a journal. So I finally found that and I put this like cute little uh, ribbon crochet fabric in the background. I thought it was really cute. So I also bound it with this green cord that I thought matched pretty well. And so then the black, the back of, of the book is just the same fabric. And you see it says homegrown, and it says organic, and then there's fruits and veggies and gardening tools and whatnot. So, if you guys want to see this flip through, definitely just keep watching. spots and there are a bunch of index cards in there too in case someone wants to use it as a recipe book but I just thought it was a really cute idea with a fork and knife <laughs> and I kind of want to keep it myself but this is actually gonna go up on Etsy I'll leave the link for my Etsy shop down below and I hope you guys like this flip through if you did don't forget to give it a thumbs up please subscribe if you haven't already thank you guys so much for watching see you next time bye